Hi guys and welcome back to Daylight. I know it's been quite some time since I did the last video but I've been pretty busy the last few days. I haven't really had a chance to properly sit down and play this. I know it's light out but it's the only time I've got today to do this so it's either this or nothing so um, I'm actually a little smidge back from where I was so I'm just going to quickly get back as I didn't actually realise it hadn't saved so it's going to quickly blast through. Yes, we've already we've already read all these lovely notes, so we don't have to worry too much about that. Yes. Let's follow her, that's not gonna go badly at all. Right, so there we go. What ails you, Sarah? <clears throat> Perhaps truth, really pure, never simple. I think what ails me is that I'm trapped in this horrible place. So some objects can be climbed like that. Okay, makes sense. Hmm. Climb back over just a minute. Let's, let's see. Can I climb this? No. Oh, there's a note here that I missed. Patients have taken their pills and are settled in after evening meals. Oh no, I've already read that one. Never mind. Do I have to light a glow stick to know what can be climbed? Or oh, that's not quite what I'm meant to do. Hmm. All I can do is sort of drop down and doesn't really achieve much to climb that. Let's see if there's anything else climbable. Uh, I suppose we can use a glow stick to find out. Let's try it. Okay, ah, I can also climb that, but it's too high. How do I climb that then? Hmm. That as well can be climbed, but it doesn't really help me. I can't get round there, can I? <laughs> the hell did I just... Did the I don't really know what I just did there. Ah, okay, you can drag it. I thought you might be able to. Boxes of ropes can be moved. Okay, that makes sense. There we go, we discovered something new today, guys. <laughs> Woohoo! Oh shit! She didn't like that. Has being out of the dark make you feel better? Well, it shouldn't. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, Miss Ghost Lady. I didn't mean to upset you by turning the lights on. Oh, I missed the thing. Can I grab it? No. And so I can move that, but that doesn't really help me. At least. Um, not at the moment. Ah, okay. Let's, let's do this. Let's. Slidey lap. No, space. I don't want to move it, I want to climb it. Space. Space. There we go. 
in space. Sweet. It is a little bit odd how you can't just jump in this game. I suppose it's to give you the more uh, the feeling of constriction a bit more. All right, let's be very careful. Walking across this. There we go. Hello. Hello. Um. Last night, approximately 7 p.m. Oh, no, no. I've read all that. Oh, I basically just climbed back to where I was. Oh, okay. Why would I... Hmm. Huh. Strange. Oh, it doesn't really... Have I got, like, a... Uh, like, a journal or notes? I can't remember... Uh, remnants. No. Oh, let's quickly grab that. So I guess that was all we had to do in that room was turn on the breaker. In fact, now that I think about it, that was my mission coming in here. Now I can't find my way back out again, which is not really great. I don't really want to have to climb all this lot again, but I think it's better than me struggling to find my way back out, even though I just went in a massive circle. Obviously, it was not my intention, guys. Sorry about this. I want to get on to the scary times. Yes, I know. Stop telling me. Thank you. So I'll sort of quickly check the time. Okay. Doop de loo. Okay, I can't go in there still. Let's go back this way. See what? No, not that way then. I. I'm very confused as to which way I'm supposed to go. Ah, there was a button here. Yes, 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 yes. Aha! This is going to go swimmingly, I feel. La 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 la. Saving content. <gasps> Hello? <gasps> Wait, there was a... there was a thing. There was a thing. Hello. There, photo. Fair enough. The little bombs transcend time and matter. Do they? Hello. Hello. Is there anybody in there? No. Hello. Patient is psych physically sorry, healthy, but deteriorating mentally. He remains in his straitjacket under constant observation. Patient continually yells at the maze is never ending. Screams continue throughout all hours of day and night, ranging from low monotone chants to fevered high pitched howls. Electric therapy is considered for tomorrow morning. Yeah, sure, solution to everything, isn't it? In asylums and films. Oh, something wrong with him. Let's shock him. I'm sure a nice burst of electricity will fix whatever's wrong with him. Hello? Mm. Hello? Oh Christ, this isn't good. <gasps> oh God. That's <laughs> just the wind. Hello? <gasps> Hello? Hello? Ooh. I don't like this, guys. 
there anything useful in there or is this room just to creep me out? I had to make my way through to that door maybe? I think this room was just to creep me out. I don't think I can get to that. No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, goodbye scary room. I don't trust you. Hello? Ooh, this is a much better. Oh god. Help me, where's my medicine? Hello? I should really get a glow stick out, shouldn't I? See if there's anything, any goodies hiding. Ooh, hello? Nothing good. Patient aged seven years has been experiencing a fear of monsters in her room at night. A night shift nurse consoled the patient by reaffirming it was only in her imagination. The patient suddenly began, subsequently rather, began exhibiting uncontrollable violence towards herself and staff members. The patient had been restrained and transported to solitary confinement. Excuse me. Sorry, guys. Hello. I really need some glow sticks. I'm running low. Ah, excellent. Dr. Watkins recommended removal of all possessions from patient's room as a means of curing her fantasies. Patient became violent during the extraction. She seemed particularly fixated on old doll and cried for days after its removal. Well, give it back to her then. What harm is a doll going to do? Hello? The fuck is that sound? Puritan Church from New Kipling pronounced that a dark time engulfed the town, prompting some inhabitants to flee in fear of their lives in order to keep the peace. The local church and, and town elders instated mandatory church attendance laws. I'll do it. Hello? Ooh. Hello? Nice lady. Oh, what the hell? My threat thing's lit. Hello? 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 Anybody? I don't see, I don't see anything. What? Where is it? I don't see anything. I genuinely don't see a thing. I turn the brightness a little bit. Brightness, brightness, brightness. There's brightness. There isn't any brightness. <laughs> Why is it in the graphics? Brightness. Yeah, let's turn that up just a little smidge. I just want to be able to see. Okay, that was a little bit too high. So I'm going to turn that back down to 15. I think oh, that's probably a good one. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Hello? I don't see why my threat thing is lit. Hello? Ooh, hello? Oh Christ. <gasps> the sigil is here. Patient reported seeing shadowy figures in his room at night. Staff has been advised to indulge patient in his illusions in order to avoid the aggressive behaviour observed in patient 15. Patient remains in his room under mild observation. Dr. Mercer, nice, nice Foster has complained that orderly William Farish disappears for hours at a time during shifts, and when he finally shows up, his hands and the knees of his pants are as dirty as those who been digging in the dirt when she asked him about it. He seems confused and asks where he can bathe. This is the fourth complaint in two weeks about Farish, and I thought the matter should be escalated to you. Hello? Are you... Hello? Hello? <gasps> the hell? Ooh. What the hell? Go away! Leave me alone! 
Leben Ellen. Oder? I don't know where the hell I'm going. Oh Christ. Le. Oh dear. What is this? <gasps> nice lady. Why do I have a giant pair of scissors? I can't be good. 